Hey, it's Woody. I've just had a pause. Um, I'm on a walk today. I'm, I think I've done seven kilometres so far, which um, which I'm really proud of and which it really pleased. Um, but on Saturday, I'm going to attempt to walk the Monopoly of Ball uh, Challenge along with uh, Graham Hooper and a great bunch of people, um, which is 22 kilometres. I don't know how my body's going to do it. I'm going to do. I'm going to do it. I've got to do it. Simple as that. I know it's uh, it's going to be one hell of a challenge. We're walking to raise uh, money for Prostate Cancer UK, which is um, an amazing organisation that uh, that that looks at ways of funding uh, research into prostate cancer. And if it wasn't for for organisations like that. I really wouldn't be here today when I was given my diagnosis last year um, of advanced prostate cancer unfortunately I was told by my doctor if, if, if that had been 10 years ago I wouldn't have made it to Christmas so I would have literally had months left to live and now I've got years I don't know how many years no one really knows how many years they got I suppose but I've got less years than perhaps I would have wanted in life. Now this message is not about me, it's about trying to, to ask you to be aware of what this disease is, to be aware of, you know, of, of this disease because I'm not going to mess around here, this disease is, is not good. No cancer is good. And I can't compare it to any other cancer because I haven't been through it. But I can say that this is a right bastard. It, it takes away your manhood, your self-esteem, your energy. It, it literally slowly takes you to pieces. And I don't want anyone else to go through this. I don't want anyone else to have this, this horrible disease. And the reason I'm putting it on a video now and the fact that we're walking on Saturday is to raise that awareness and, and, and to tell people out there look I know lots of guys in their 50s that probably have never heard of a PSA test for prostate cancer never got themselves checked up I never knew about it I was diagnosed with uh, sciatica don't know why I wasn't given a PSA test only they know that and that's something I'm going to have to live with. And I'm not moaning about it. The thing is that you watching this video, if you're, if you're a man and you're in your 50s and you're starting to get maybe bladder problems getting up in the night more frequently to go to the toilet, you're starting to get back pains that are very similar to sciatica. Now these pains were shooting down my right side and they were excruciating pains. There wasn't, there wasn't to do with sciatica. It was due to the fact that I've got tumours in my back, where the cancer spread. And like I said, I just don't want anyone else to go through what this is for my, you know, the hell my family have had to go through. You know, particularly my wife, my children, and the rest of my family. And that's what I'm trying to do, to raise that awareness. And, and if this video just makes one person that looks at it go, I'm gonna have a PSA test, or I'm gonna go and see my doctor about this back pain that's been going on for a while, or my toilet habits are getting are changed, blood has changed, then please take notes of it because it really could be life-saving, I mean that. Now on, to, on Saturday we're gonna we're gonna do this challenge where we're gonna walk around the streets of London in various landmarks that are on the Monopoly board, and uh, it's gonna be tough. But it's gonna be fun. I'm really looking forward to it, especially as I haven't seen some of these guys for many years. I look forward to meeting up with them. But the main thing is we want to raise money, and we want to raise money by asking you to donate to Just Giving, the Just Giving Fund, 
and our team, Team Woody it's called. I'll put a link in below. I've asked a lot of people, I've been doing a lot of fundraising and I've asked a lot of people to, 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 to give. And uh, I've been astonished by the amount of people that have, that have supported me. And um, I'm asking again that if you can you can spare anything for this because I think this is going to be the disease of the future. One in eight men, one in four black guys. Can you believe that? Are going to have prostate cancer and. If it's caught early enough, there's a good chance you're not going to have to go through the shit that I'm going through. And I believe me, there's some stuff that I don't even want to talk about. But you get my drift. It's just not good. So, please, 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 support us on this um, on this really important fundraising event. and give what you can. Thank you so much, thank you so much for watching it. And take care.